Hello, how to solve x square minus 1 brackets square is equal to 2 x square minus 2 to find the values of x from this equation. Now from this expression inside the bracket square is same as x square minus 1 bracket times itself x square minus 1 bracket is equal to this 2 x square minus 2. Then in next step x square times x square is x power 4. x square times negative 1 is minus x square. Minus 1 times x square is minus x square. Negative 1 times negative 1 is positive 1 is equal to this 2x square minus 2. Then in next step, it will be this x power 4. Negative x square, negative x square is negative 2x square. Then plus 1 is equal to this 2 x square minus 2. Then in next step, it will be this x power 4. This we take to this side, so it will be negative 2x square with negative 2x square is negative 4x square. This negative 2 we take to this side, it will be 1 plus 2, it is plus 3 is equal to 0. Then our equation will be from x power 4 is same as x square bracket square minus 4x square plus 3 is equal to 0. Then from here x square is common. So we let u is equal to x square. Then here to be u square then minus 4u then plus 3 is equal to 0. Then in next step we'll solve this quadratic equation by factorization. So it will be u square, then minus 4u is same as minus 3u minus u, then plus 3 is equal to 0. Then from here u is common. So we take u out of bracket, u square divided by u is u, negative 3u divided by u is negative 3 bracket, then in here negative 1 is common, so we take negative 1 out of bracket, this divided by this is u, 3 divided by negative 1 is negative 3 bracket is equal to 0. Then in next step, in here u minus 3 is common, so we take u minus 3 out of bracket, then to be u minus negative 1 bracket is equal to 0. Then in next step, we substitute the values of u, whereas before we let u is equal to x square. So, in here it will be x square minus 3 bracket, then bracket, this to be x square minus 1 bracket is equal to 0. Then, in this equation, we have two solutions, whereas first solution is x square minus 3 is equal to 0, and the second solution is this x square minus 1 is equal to 0. Now, in here, we take that 3 to the right side, so it will be x square is equal to 3. Then we apply square root in both sides. So this square root will cancel with square, then it will be x is equal to, in here, it will be plus or minus square root of 3. So these are the values of x, and so from here, we take that 1 to the right side, so it will be x square is equal to 1. Then we apply square root in both sides. So this square root will cancel with square, then it will be x is equal to square root of 1 is plus or minus 1. Also these are the other values of x. To solve in another method, from this our problem, which is x square minus 1 bracket square is equal to, in here 2 is common, so we take 2 out of bracket, 2x square divided by 2 is x square, negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 1, bracket. Then in next step, from here x square minus 1 is common. So we let t is equal to x square minus 1. Then in here it will be t square is equal to 2, then this is t. So we take 2t to the left side. So it will be t square minus 2t is equal to 0. Then, in here t is common. 
So we take t out of bracket, t squared divided by t is t, negative 2, t divided by t is negative 2, bracket is equal to 0. Then from here, we have two solutions, whereas first solution is t is equal to 0, and the second solution is t minus 2 is equal to 0. But in before, we let t is equal to x squared minus 1. So we we'll substitute the value of t, which is x square minus 1 is equal to 0. And here t is x square minus 1, then minus 2 is equal to 0. Then from the first solution, we take negative 1 to the right side, so it will be x square is equal to 1. Then we apply square root in both sides. Then this square root will cancel with square, then x is equal to square root of 1 is plus or minus 1. So these are the values of x, and to solve from here, it will be x square, negative 1 with negative 2, it will be negative 3 is equal to 0. Then we take negative 3 to the right side, so it will be x square is equal to 3. Then we apply square root in both sides. So this square root will cancel with square, then it will be x is equal to plus or minus square root of 3. So these are the other values of x. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.